It's been a long 23 years, but for the first time since 1993, the World Series is in Toronto as the Toronto Blue Jays will play host to the Los Angeles Dodgers who won the National League this year. And the AL did have home field advantage due to winning the All-Star game. That was a thing that I did not show during the regular season. But the World Series will start at Rogers Center as it is hosted by the record-breaking Toronto Blue Jays team, the best team in MLB history by win total. Troy Tulowitzki, bottom of the first, and playoff Kershaw is in true form as he gives up a leadoff single to Troy Tulowitzki, and that is going to put a runner on, and that will bring up Kevin Pillar, the number two hitter, to the plate, and he is going to see on a 3-2 count a ball very far outside in that slider, which will bring up Josh Donaldson, another 3-2 count, and that is another slider outside of the zone. Jose Bautista would strike out, but here's Edwin Encarnacion, and he lines it up the middle, and that is going to be the first two runs of the World Series, and they wasted no time with only one out in the top of the first, or the bottom of the first inning, excuse me, and now Chris Colabello up to bat, and he is going to draw a walk, and so that loads the bases once again, and so Clayton Kershaw has allowed six, five of the first six runners to reach base, and Justin Smoke is going to score two more. A 4 to nothing lead here in the first inning for Toronto, and that is going to start off the game pretty well for them. Top of the fourth inning, Adrian Gonzalez up to bat. Sonny Gray was on the mound for us, and this would be his only mistake all day. Home run right there. Solo shot for Agon, and that is going to cut the lead to three, but it took away from an otherwise great game from Sonny Gray and now Chris Hatcher on the mound and Troy Tulowitzki is going to draw the walk right there and so that puts a runner on as the offense got kind of stagnant after that first inning explosion but Kevin Pillar right here at the bat and Troy Tulowitzki is going to advance on that dropped ball right there or passed ball excuse me and now a 32 count for Kevin Pillar and that is high and out of the zone and he is going to draw the walk right there and that will bring up Josh Donaldson once again with a 3-2 count, and he is going to walk. So very similar to this first inning so far. Three straight walks for the Toronto Blue Jays. It was a single instead of a walk the other time. And Jose Bautista, Joey Bats, is going to take this out into left field. A grand slam, 8-1 to one lead, and that would pretty much do it. We will bring in the old man, R.A. Dickey, to finish out the game. And he had a pretty solid top of the ninth inning. This is going to be Justin Turner right here. And he is going to strike out on an inside knuckleball. And that is going to be a strikeout for R.A. Dickey. And this is going to be another strikeout for R.A. Dickey right here. Finishes the game strong. The old man makes his first World Series appearance. And he is going to finish out this game. So that will do it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoy. Stay tuned for the next episode which will be the conclusion of the World Series, so stay tuned.